Hi guys, my name is Mitz and I want to show you something today about getting a Google penalty. Now I have one um, in the last couple of days on Tips for PC which is a huge website um, and anyway now I want to tell you one little thing that is pretty bad. Um, unnatural end inbound links is the bad one okay this is the one when it's inbound links this is where you lose your ranking in the search engine now the other one is unnatural outbound links now that um, is say if you have bad anchor text and you try and or paid links or um, I mean it might not be paid links but it is anchor text that might seem like it's paid links or it's trying to rank in the search engines. Okay, so just say I had a, a guest post in there and it had um, anchor text SEO India or whatever. Um, that would be probably considered as an unnatural outbound link. Now, this penalty, the outbound link, if it was just that one there, then the site would still be in the search engines, but you'd lose your page rank. Okay, so Tips for PC had a page rank about four or three or whatever, and now it's got zero on it. So that lost the page rank. Okay, this one here, the unnatural inbound links, is the links pointing to the site. Now it lost the actual search engine um, listing so that means that the site is dropping out of the search engines okay so I could just go down the bottom here uh, and show you how it's just completely dropped now look this has happened to me before okay um, I've had a bit of trouble with the site at the moment um, and look I've been there here and done this um, I haven't had these actual warnings before but I've definitely dropped out of the search engines before and that was because of um, errors and stuff like that now okay what I'm going to do is just show you how to um, get your links so so you can you know check them out um, start going and sending people emails and stuff like that so I'll just pull this over here we're going to go to search traffic and we're going to go to links to your site and here here it is it says 53,973 links now um, this here mr. what is dot net okay it's got 13,000 links going to my website now I'm not very happy about that one uh, WordPress is pretty normal because remember that WordPress is a free blogging site and it has a lot of websites on it okay so that's okay um, I don't know about this one but I dare say it is something like mr. what is where it just brings in your links or title of your post from an RSS feed and just pumps it all through um, and same with this one ask Ives or whatever it is I don't know what it's called um, it's starting to get up there as well with 4,000 and something links now if I just press on the more button now straight away it says download this table download the latest links uh, download more sample links now um, just looking at this now um, you can scroll down and you can see what you're looking for is um, just say because I've got a computer website so I'm looking for links that are related to computer websites and they're and they're decent um, decent websites okay uh, YouTube yep probably related to computers uh, you know most of the time Windows talks about Windows um, 
Mr. What Is again down here. Um, there's a lot of these spammy uh, question websites. Yahoo.com, uh, yeah, etc., etc. Okay, PC Pit Stop. These are good links, okay? Those few things are good links. The rest are not that good. Okay, so what I did is I just pressed it on this here. Download the latest links and it comes up with CSV and you press OK. Okay, because I want to see what the hell is going on. Because obviously I have a big problem. Now, after downloading that sheet... I actually already have something open down here and I'm just going to open it up. Now I'll go to the page. Now what I did is um, it's actually sorted. When I got this list it was sorted. I'll just go over. It was sorted from um, in date order. So the links from 2014 were up the top. Okay, so there's the actual uh, URL, and if I just move it over to the next column, you can see the date there. Now, I actually selected all of 2014 links, so if I scroll up, there's going to be a big gap there because I've stolen, you can see that, oh, I've stolen the 2014 links from there. I stole the whole lot. Okay, I just, um, and that look, there's 7,000 of them in 2014. And we're only in to the third month, January, February, March. So when I saw that, I was a little bit worried about it. So I'm just going to delete those cells and shift them up. Okay, so what we've got there, we're starting at 2013. Now, what I'm trying to look at is 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 getting 6,000 links in a year is that normal so if I go right down um, to the end basically let's go back now this is where this actual domain started in 2007 now here are the links they're not not that many for the whole year right we've got that many okay now if I um, just have to go back over to the date again right so let's have a look at 2008 this is how many links the site got in 2008 which is a fair bit more Whoop. it's not as many as 6,000 though that's for sure so that's how many it is Right, so what have we got? We've got just say 20,000 from 20,400. So basically we got about 200 and something. Just say 250 links. Okay, and you can have a look at them. Now, that a lot of that is junk. That computer info center, what are that's junk. I know that. Um if you just go through, there's a couple of junk ones there, but the rest are not bad. Okay, so obviously the next lot up here is 2009, but as you can see, there is a bit of a, obviously getting 6,000 links in one year is not right. Okay, so let's see how many I had in 2009. Oh. Ah, not many at all. So let's have a look. So we're 20,314 to 20,400 and something. So 100, 100 and something. Oh my God. So this, obviously, this looks terrible, right? I pasted 2014 links in here. Now here they are, look, 7,091 links in 2014. Now, a lot of that is from Mr. What, what Is or whatever it is, 
right so um, what I'm going to do is sort this and I'm going to show you how much is from Mr. What Is. So I'm just going to click on this little triangle up here and select them all. Then I'm going to go right up to the top. I'm going to show you up here in the corner it says sort and filter. I'm going to press on it and I'm just going to choose A to Z. Okay now make sure you've got all the columns selected. I'll pull this over. So make sure you've got both of these selected so the date moves with the URL because you don't want to wreck the actual um, they're tied together okay otherwise it doesn't make any sense. So if we go d scroll down now and we can see we'll look at this answer party for starters let's take that one there's a lot okay radio now that is way too many for one website now obviously it's shown very clearly on um, webmaster tools how many links are coming from this site but you don't know that they're all coming in like you know in such a short period of time okay um, it just doesn't look right now also we've got um, go down further see some of these links are really good from the um, this forum here that's good um, yeah this one you know a couple of geek sites is good and all that um, I'll be able to show you how to tell whether they're even you know they're pretty good um, this link check 10 I have no idea what that is but um, better check that out keep going down now let's have a look at this mister what is here it is here it starts here starts at 700 okay so let's say now we'll scroll down and now I have been to this mister what is site and I don't think there is any way to contact them so with this particular site I would say you would have to go and use the disavow tool you know the tool where you say discount don't recognize any links from this site so this is crazy now if I don't I definitely have the right to go and get rid of these now look at this from 700 to 5200 now oh what's that 4500 links okay so I got 4500 links from um, in 2014 from Mr. What Is so 4500 links whoa from one website and and you wonder why Google has put a penalty on my website I had no idea um, that this kind of thing was going on so obviously uh, to build 4500 links in about um, what three months January February March um, it's not very good now as I showed you previously I built in a year I built about 100 or 200 I mean not look I didn't even build these links but this is how it happened um, 100 or 200 um, links a year okay um, yeah I didn't build I didn't do link building I uh, just didn't have time I mean you're too busy creating content and all that but when these links get built like this it really doesn't look good all right um, so um, these are crazy now the other thing is that I was going to go to a website to tell which links are bad and you know which ones I should get rid of um, I'll just scroll down to get past this mister what is or whatever right so just say uh, I take a sample of some links here so let's just say I take a bit of this and a bit of that okay just take um, those ones and copy them now I'm gonna go to I'm just gonna find the website 
oh here it is here it's called uh, it's DA D domain authority checker okay it's just um, bulk DA checker dot com and you just paste those URLs in there just a sample of them I'm having and just press find find it and it'll go through now if we just scroll down to the bottom we can see that it's actually working it's actually finished there okay so here's the domain authority and on some of the websites it says anything under 25 or whatever is not good or maybe even under 30 okay now on that list earlier I saw ones that had number one on them so that wasn't good at all um, so you can check out these like you can see that it's not that great you know this is not that great okay so let's also open the link in another tab and check it out and see what it is so obviously this is a forum response which really you have no control over whatsoever um, because they've linked to a few things here but the thing is that this site is dead this site is dead um, I can tell that it has no Alexa ranking it has no page rank nothing and um, we'll also check out the main URL so I'll just take this up the top so I'll strip off all that was there and just go to the main URL and it doesn't have anything okay so uh, it's not looking good for that site I mean it's not one of the worst but it's just not looking good okay so um, if you if you want to check a few things out um, you can also go there and see if there's any contact like can you contact anyone here to say Oh, um, can you remove my link you know what I mean or whatever um, I mean this this site doesn't look that good or anything but I don't sometimes you just haven't got any control over anything and um, you can try and contact people here it says someone's name there maybe you can click on that oh there we go an email right there we go um, sometimes there's nothing so you when you're trying to um, just tell Google um, I contacted the sites um, some removed their links some didn't so I've put I've used the disavow tool for these sites and blah 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 um, yeah apparently you have to be very detailed in it and to tell the truth I have not done this before because as I said I have lost rankings before but I have never um, lost it for bad backlinks or anything like that um, because I didn't really go around link building too much or anything like that I just created content and um, anyway now I've got this link thing I've got to go and fix it so basically I am going to contact webmasters that I think you know like if there's an unrelated link or there's a link that looks spammy or um, it's on a website that has nothing to do with computers um, or something like that okay so if it just does not belong there I want to contact them and say could you please remove it if they don't I need to use the disavow tool to stop them from linking to me and um, that's about it and then I put in a reconsideration request to Google okay now if you've got this outbound um, what was it I'll just go back to the webmaster tools let's go back um, go back to the site dashboard where it says what penalties I've got and it's this one the inbound okay now if you've got that inbound one 
I suggest you start working on that first okay like I said the outbound one is not as bad because you don't get thrown out of the search engines well I haven't for my other site um, the reason I know this is because my other site has a penalty just for the outbound links that are pointing out because it says hey you're giving away page rank juice so we're taking your page rank away basically so um, this one here is you've got links pointing to you and uh, you don't deserve to rank in the search engines all right um, thanks for watching um, if I do get all this repaired I will definitely uh, make another video about it and how I did it. Alright, thank you.